All right. Welcome to this Adventures in the Forgotten Realms Dungeons and Dragons crossover Magic the Gathering pre release. I don't even know what game we're Did you playing. say Adventures in or Adventures in the? Adventures in the Forgotten Realms. Adventures yeah. in the Forgotten Realms. I keep forgetting the. 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 To the coast. Oh. Has a row. All right. Let's get something sweet. All right. That is not really that sweet. I got a, what'd you get? I got a den of the bugbear. I got an instruments, instrument, instrument of the bards. Ooh, look at these tokens though. These are kind of oh, cool. That's pretty sweet. Oh, these are the dungeons. That oh, there's the dungeons. Okay. And they're foily? Foily dungeons. And, and they have the, and they're the, the tokens the, the token on the other side, yeah. That's actually really nice. Where's this, where's the D20? At the bottom. This is a random, right? Yeah. Do you see how the die is different? It's not spin down. Correct. Yeah, yeah. We, did, we did just say that. Like he's in here. Am I being weird sense. about saying yeah. No, no. It's, it's, it's because you roll. Die. Yeah. So you can roll it. My promo was charging stuff. That's kind of cool. Look at that right. premium removal. We got a rapier. I got a. So like these are super odd because like you got to read the manual to know which cards and cards. Like I don't even know what stuff. color this is. Oh, uh, woo! All right, so pack one's not too shabby. I don't know how good it would be in sealed here, but we got uh, an Elowick tumble stream. You can't even discount the magic missile. Oh yeah, yeah, you can't discount. That's a classic. It's really good. I like the bag of holding with some uncommon now. Oh, can I even? Can you even like build around her? I'm, I'm assuming you can. I think I, he just generates value. Which is yeah. You're in green. Like I think that's just good. I can remember how to open packs. So we've got two wins here, which I think are pretty good. I'm like what color is? Where's blue? This one here. Uh, Brazilax. It floods scholar. Whenever a creature you control becomes blocked, but you may return it to its owner's hand. Or one more creature should control the common ship player draw a card. Right. Yeah, I see your meeting. I'm like, I don't know what the frick this is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, which part? Like, what color is this? Oh, yeah. That yeah, was multicolored. <laughs> so, yeah. White dragon. Pack one. Green planeswalker. Yeah, but I got a dog. Oh, you're throwing trash. Yeah. I got a loyal dog. Spike pit. All right. All right. I forgot there's some multicolored cards. But are you here? Battle hammer. Green's looking pretty good. Uh, that will probably be. Like, I like that card. 1-1 one, one artifact flyer for one. Wretched Twitch Willow. Oh, White Dargan. Ooh, and the, this, a, this is the counter spell, that's right. I got, I, got a, I got a White Dargan. I got a White Dargan. And I got a Dargan Turtle. Dragon Tribal. Dargan Turtle. You're going to play Dungeons and you're going to play Dragons. You're insane. Dungeons and Dragons. Ooh, critical hit. We did a 20. Ooh, deck of many things. I like critical hit. I have to play this. I don't, yeah. I don't know what it's going to do. <laughs> <laughs> Precipitous drop. All right. And a Grim Bounty. Okay, so I've got good removal in black. I could make me discard my entire hand. A mind player? Ooh. Oh, vampire spawn. Mind player's kind of scary. My player's pretty good. Here, this guy looks kind of scary too. But my like green black looks pretty good. I think so far. So I actually really like this card, the wild shape. I do too. Because it's like a protect four. It can just like. I think we're. I think, I think we're playing uh, Golgari. These look so weird. <laughs> So, Canon Sentry, uh, Guardian of Faith. Um, yeah, creatures phase out and stuff. Power word kill. <laughs> Love to see it. Yeah, Power word kill seems pretty good. Yes. Ooh, black red. I might have to look at like. Wait, I don't think I have as much as I would like. You find a cursed idol. I think it's just really good for that like. Uh, it's the three mobile spells, so like destroy an artifact, destroy an enchantment, or create a treasure token adventure in the dungeon for two. It's sorcery speed, but... Baleful Beholder. 
You have more, more D20 things. And I got a Volo. So I got a Gretchen Twitch Will and a Volo. Uh -huh. Sudden Insight. Hmm. Just a Spike Trap, which I don't know how good that would be. Uh, whenever you cast a creature that doesn't share a creature type with a creature control or a creature card in your graveyard, cut that spell. What do you say, Gretchen Trich Willow? Gretchen. Gretchen Trich Willow? Gretchen Titch Willow. Titch Willow. Titch Willow. Why was I adding a card there? Gretchen Titch Willow. They have some kind of insane names on this. Yeah. <laughs> I actually, like, I'm going to start right off and look to see what, uh, what Golgari looks like here. Yeah. Seems like there's some pretty good. Well, pretty are you totally lost? Uh, no, no not, no, not completely. Not there. No. I, it's the dog illusion. <laughs> so what's this do? At the beginning of your upkeep, you may put a harmony counter in instrument of the bards. Search for a creature card, mana value, equal the number of harmony counters on it. Reveal it, put it in your hand. If that card is legendary, create a treasure token in the shovel. It's a lot like, uh, was it, it's like Yes and the Wanderer card, right? From gotcha, those yeah. Corsets? I don't know which one. I think I can play that. Uh, that dude's okay. Uh... Jelly's oh, this psyched me out so much. I didn't know what the freak this was. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's one of the one of the lands. Yeah. <laughs> so that's I'm like, four. oh my gosh, what is this? I got two creature lands. I don't know what it's gonna do, but I don't know how I feel about that actually. Like, I don't even know if you can you play. This is the beautiful bird. It's like. Basically, a six mana murder, right? But Something like that. Do I show them the code? Like, I have two, and I have two deadly disputes. You know what? But... They can have the code. Ooh. How nice of you. I haven't played Arena in like three months, so. Oh. <laughs> I ain't too much. Okay. Power, so. Ah, I gotcha. Well, blue is just a bad color, right? I don't actually know. I'm kidding, but my blue is bad. I think this walk is actually. I have two bullets. I don't, I don't know if two is actually like, needed. The bullet. Boulet. It's a bullet. It's a bullet. Boulet. 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 French. I don't know if you play two, you find a first title, you know, play strengths, right? So, like, this isn't horrible. I don't even think you play that. Because, like, is there anything that you play creature That feels like a really hardcore, like, build around card. The instrument? Yeah. I can't not play deck of many things, though, because this card is just fun. That's what we're here for. <laughs> I think you have to. Like, I think you just have to play it. Um, it's my red. This card's bad. So rapier, price of loyalty, and I'm no fan. And pair of goblins, okay. I'm not really rolling magic whistle. It's like it's not horrible, but I don't think it's. I have like two creatures. Three creatures total in red, so I think that's kind of out of the question. Hmm. Hmm. Blue actually doesn't look horrible. There's a dragon turtle. Dude, white dragon, honestly, it seems kind of insane. Yeah, white dragon's not bad. <laughs> Curious if, like, this thing can actually get triggered, like, enough. Oh, uh, it's decent enough, I think. It's kind of huge if it is. Yeah. I'm at 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, so I've actually like if I played this this way, it's twenty five cards, and so if I cut like deadly dispute twenty four. Oh, uh, 
Just choose your weapon again. Double target creature's power. Yes. Five damage to your creature flying. Which is actually like that's super relevant, right? With the dragons that are in the set. So if I so if I cut one to spew, it's twenty-four cards. Holy crap. It's gonna be like a super quick I made something deck. I kinda just wanna put them all in place. <laughs> like I kind of just want to play Bolo because like like these are just they're both just seem good. But I don't have I don't have an evolving models. Do you have any of like these things? Mm -hmm. it's like... I don't have any temples either. But like I could play I could play Volo and just play like two islands. Um because I could also cast it off of a treasure. Do you have? Oh, I was gonna say, do you have other base? Like, it depends on how much treasure you have. If you have enough treasure, it might be pretty good. Well, yeah, that's what I was looking at. It's like there isn't a ton, but there's some. Um, that card has enough utility. Like, I yeah, I'm thinking like kind of bullet for it. Boule, a boule, me. a boule. I don't think I want just to play leather Bolo. armor. Like Bolo seems really good. And the question is, can I play? Gretchen, I, I don't think I can. I mean, I, I think it. he's worth it to get down later, but her late is bad. That's the and that's really what I'm looking at. Is it's like, so sure, I could pay four, but like, if I can't reliably get the four or the island, you know, what I mean? if I had a Bobby Wilds, I, don't, I, don't think, I think it would be a, it'd be a thing, but I don't feel like she's worth it because I feel like if you're like when you're at that late of a point in game two, you're never going to be able to double activate it either, right? Right. So I think it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, yeah. Six, seven, seven. I, I know that's right. Twenty-four. It's just twenty-four cards, so I could actually play just a forty-one card deck. Which seems to be like generally my standard. <laughs> Cause why not? Also, no, we're like playing three rounds. It's based on prizes are based on your record. So it's not that bad. I think I have to play, like, just splash it the one. I think I have to play two islands, right? Or just in case. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen. Ooh, it's pretty even split between 17 lands and since 15. If I do two islands. Um, so I just do an 8-7 split. I think. This okay. Is, I think it's like the most specific, like, entered the battlefield. Mm -hmm. yeah, I think it's... Like, yeah, I'm not... I'm not huge on it, but the uh, creature control game minutes until end of turn is not bad. Yeah, I feel like yeah. I mean, if you have a board, yeah. Imagine having a board. I think we go. Yeah, we do. Did we do eight swamps because of the double black on the top end? No double. Oh, I do have one double green. Hmm. Also, I guess I keep forgetting that I'm going to have. I'm, I'm probably going to have some number of treasures. I know it's wrong, but I'm playing everything that lets me roll a die. That's fine. Did you get the dude that, like, when you roll a die, deals one damage? I have one of him, yeah. But that's. I think he's the only payoff. Uh oh. <laughs> it's not worth it. It's just very. That's all right. You didn't get the, playing. You didn't get the artist, though, did you? The what? The painter? I uh, don't. Uh, no. Man. Yeah, it's she's like a two mana. Mm, it's the Rakdos one, right? Yep. Yeah. yeah. It's pretty good. So this turns a thing into a treasure company. Yeah. Seems good. 
so much equipment. Holy crap. I guess I do. Bago holding, huh? I don't know how I feel about that. It seems all right, but I know my mana's really bad, so gotcha. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna have to loot away or off color cards a lot, right. which is probably like again bad deck building. But we're gonna we're gonna be greedy like this. I mean, this is the time to be greedy, right? Figure out what you're doing, how you're gonna do it. Not so on that card. Running on some does. Oh, six mana roll a d20. Yeah. It's good if you're in, I think, like a control style deck, but... Oh, this, oh, this card's really bad. <laughs> yeah. I, I I just read it. I didn't even read it. I thought this was just like an ETB. Oh. Yeah, like, it, it, it could end up being way better than I give it credit for. I That's don't, so slow. I just don't think it is. That's so slow. Both of those are really good. I'm like, I'm the beholder. Yeah, I'm not... I have, like, I can side him in if I need them. I have much better options. I have so many cards. Be a problem. Here, do we like the thing with the bigger butt and it dies? The one that enters and the one that dies. How much, uh, how much of uh, venturing stuff do you have? Uh, right now, I actually have a decent amount. But they both venture. I was just one, saying, one's just on DTB and one's just on. I guess I'm more aggressive. Let's just. That's fine. But your splash color, I guess, is another thing, right? That's true. I think it's white. But I really want white dragon. Ah. Uh, I mean, you have a temple. Mm -hmm. You have you have a white cave, and you have Den of the Bugbear. So, like. Sure this is 40 cards because you know me well so this would be fine if this is a 60 card deck but you have that many cuts to make i have that many cuts to make wow. <laughs> all right i don't like these guys I don't know what you're This is removal. I'm keeping. How many goblins do you have? Which goblins? Any goblins? Well, that guy's a goblin. This guy yeah, might be a goblin. He is a goblin, yep. Yeah. And. Because he gets, he gets first strike on pack tactics. It's also a 3 1, just yeah. on nice. Oh, you have swarming goblins, and you see a pair of goblins. Okay. Well, I mean, it doesn't matter. Like, like is there anything off that creature type? No, no. It's just the it's fact just, that I have a lot of goblins. Yeah, because like they're usually cheap and quick. But like, a pair of goblins pumps your team or makes two more goblins. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like that one. I guess like you're the life linker. So you're the. I think I have enough dudes to die for the tragic backstory. For this it doesn't have to be on your turn. I know. Like that's the nice part about it. Yeah, I do have enough for that. I think. And then what's Force One going? Oh, that's the rare, right? Uh, yeah. It's a little. It's a little bit like a worse version of Night of the Evil Legion. I feel like. I don't think it's bad. I, mean, I think it's really good for this. I think it's okay. It was me hexproof. I don't know how I'm gonna work with that. It was just a one three. Let's drop that one. Oh, it makes treasures. Makes treasures of a hit people. Yeah. I'd rather have these like three ones, I think.
That dude's good. You like this guy a lot? Oh, yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of things that are like... I guess I don't know like how best... The... I like... Plenty of barbarians. Seems all right. I don't know what that one is. Oh, it's like a threat. No. It's like anchor treason type thingy. Gotcha. Yeah, right. I don't really have any life gain. These guys aren't like bad. That's so much. Point, you know. Yeah, well, you cut, you cut the one life gainer, right? So, like, unicorn is not that great anymore. Yeah, I did. Yeah. Where I cut, like, one of these guys. Let's, yeah, let's white, do it. White is your splash, for sure. Yes. I guess I can move this guy. Yeah, I, I haven't really been sold on, on him. Like... I guess there's a couple of things that it could be good against. It might be like a weird sideboard option. Yeah. Kind of. Still 28 cards. <laughs> yeah. I honestly don't yeah. really like dropping this, but at the same time, like, I don't have white or really that much. I think. What's that? It's just the hog. It's like oh, I mean, you gotta t you gotta use two creatures to. It's venture. like a million mana to do the adventure. It's yeah. just like is the one one flyer. Yeah, yeah, I don't think it is. I'm almost like it's weird, but it's like you almost just splash white for like that that that. Like yeah, you just get rid of that dungeon here. Is that even worth it? Like, you hear something is good, I guess. What is that card? I like this thing. Yeah. It's removal. Yep. I mean, it's just a 5-3. I have no equipment. Doesn't do anything without equipment? No. Yeah. Oh, that's the free... Is that the, the, the it's free the free equip. equip one. Gotcha. Yeah. How many creatures do you have? Critical hit. It does sound like a lot of fun. But... How many dice rolls do you have? That's going to be the next question. Kind of a lot, actually. This is kind of a creature, but. Yeah. Little creatures. This is a creature. So my dice rolling this is also a creature. I have one, two, three, four. I have four things. I think. So the next question is: If raising dwarf worth it? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I mean, this is like some, a lot of these are repeatable. Fifteen. Oh, this is just enter. Um, you know, like this is the only repeatable one, I think. You, have, you only have 15 creatures. Yeah. We get now 23. 23. <laughs> 23 sounds good to me. That's the amount of thought we put into it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well that's it. Let him figure out his mana base. Sleeve up and. Uh, what time do we have? Oh, we've got like. We'll catch you I've back got like. For, uh, minutes. for some play.